wangu sasa sikia kwa makini Yesu mtetezi wangu simba wa yuda ameshanguruma jeni ndani asiye ogopa jua jetena sika mambo na kondoo bali kama simba kama simba toka za yuda simba akiburu Shingani fane, 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 Shit. 
mimi ili ya wahubiri hamkuzingatia sasa neema yake imekwisha hasira yake imekuja usikie kwa sauti ya bwana ikikuita usisite site Você 
kidogo na tunapoendelea kusikiza nyimbo yule mwenye yakona gari KAJ 858Z pickup akuje tu hapa nyuma kwa hii probox iko hapa nyuma akutane na kamau Do 
Yeah.
Tunazidi kubalikiwa sana na hizo nyimbo. Walio kenti chini tunabalikiwa? Eh tunafurahia kabisa. Tangazo moja tu tafadhali. Ah uh, badala okay, wale wanaenda msalani badala ya kwenda na kule juu ati tunasubuana na machefu wenye wako na huko. Hapa nyum uh, hapa tumepaki magari. Hiyo boma iko pale. Tunaweza kutumia zile ziko pale chini. Kwa wanaume naona kuna pali pa metegenezo pale kalipu na ile gali ya ni hasa mani hach, hash kuligana na yale maji umekunywa hapo tu wanaume tuko na pahali hapo kwa hivyo tuendele tu kubalikiwa na hizo nyimbo Nikoya ya SDA pale Dhika na tunazidi kubalikiwa Oh 
ni mwatu ingila ya kamuno, asate ni sama. Na yule tokuru kama atonu, reverend nini ya kinya, wogo tulu kama nengenda tuwa pirelie, ashinyo mwitalete ni, tulu kama nengenda tuwa yukam, pasta, tuwa pirelie, ibogona ni ito. Asate ni sana tu. Loga mai, eh, loga mai, nengenda tuwa pirelie, pasta ni ya kinya, Kau kau terukam ini kita, nanti. Thank you, Nitodo. Wambo the nyawa umo the na hidari the watu kinyeria. Tukeruta muere wa Samuel. Ani geda gaida wikwa matuine todie toto gori gogo na riake. Waho ya mwa dani wito mwe mwa the we take care go to him we take mwe ga na gogo na riaga. The yore tu ane da yowa. The yore tu ane boga boga ku na the yore tu o ne mega wa. Le umwadani orani mega go na riere na wero yuko tu kuruta tu rute tu yete ine waku na ni tondo wake cheso umwadani na mohono kiemi tu amen ni tu kuri ya duri akama na ni amwe area mara kura kwa hamu na Samuel na tiki le boka nigeta marute ida do ere nigeta tu dihari hogo na ine karibu ni mase. Nekore forodi mwega ma na toke teki ya tuawona amuka inya to ideo kuo atodo deka ge da moshi igo. Oh, no. 
Yesu asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe sana. Tupungie mkono tafadhali kama watuona. Haleluya. Tunayo furaha ya Bwana asubuhi ya leo kwa ajili ya wema na ukuu wake na hasa kwa hii siku ambayo wametupa ili tukaweze kupata hii ibada ya ili tukaweze kumpungia heri mwenda zake ndugu yetu, baba yetu, rafiki yetu, mshirika pamoja nasi. Bwana Samuel Dongo na tutaomba ya kwamba Mungu atazidi kutupa neema yake na wema wake tukiendeleza hii ibada. Nitaomba uh, tuweze kupata mahali ambapo uh, Mama Dolkas na Mama wa Mboi wataonyeshwa mahali ambapo wataweza kuketi ili tuweze kuendelea. Waonyeshwe mahali ambapo wataweza kuketi ili tuweze kuendelea. Sijui kama ni viti ambao hawana ama ni nini. MC Akoromatiko muhete hago ikara muke to ikare na inyui haha. Eh ukai to ikare o haha. Oh mai kali oro haha tuli. Eh eh mai kali oro haha muke ruwini. Karibuni. Good. na tuombe Baba Mwenyezi na Mwenye Rehema twakusifu na twasema ni asanti kwa wema na ukuu wako Ni asanti kwa maana umetupa hii siku ili baba tukaweze kufanya hii ibada na ili baba sifa na utukufu zikaweze kukurejea Tuomba ya kwamba utakuwa pamoja nasi kufuruliza hadi mwisho Nazo baraka zako zikawe juu ya kila mmoja wetu na hasa katika hii familia Na ili baba hawa wapendwa wako wakaweze kukuona ukiwatendea makuu kwa maana wewe ni Mwenyezi Mungu. Tubaliki sasa na Mungu wetu uzidi kutupa amani ambayo inatokana kwako. Na hili ndilo ombi letu katika jina la Mungu Baba, Mungu Mwana na Mungu Roho Mtakatifu. Amen. Tukikuikarawe, reke iturugame o ule kasiga nuona. Na noto ede arame na program ulewe na program ete kira kusihi hea na oto kito makasi wuya to go doma na gaine go tuwe kawega arame na mafuku mage domo ito kia kan dawa agrika peji na bang be igana na mirogo keda na igere na maria meru peji ye one hari na ninety seven udi na abre na igo go na. Nyeki neo maga namo mahua makahoha. Nego koruo mehomo ya jehofa ne mahomo keire. Tidero anumahana ota nyeki. Kuradhi mwole ne alea marasaka ya leu todo ne makuwa mire liyo. Alea male wigua no na kere. Ikuwa leao leo doe fata maido ine maa jehofa. Olea oka hota na nega mwetekira nega mwetekiria aikare hamwe nani gete inega ya kwa kia onene otona ida to lidie na geikara hamwe na wa gete inega ya kia onene ri olea wena matone igwe olea roho alera makanida we ikaraga ole mwe hokeku o ginya mudo nya wago kua na nega kuhe dobe ya mwoyo Turu kami tanya guru, kau jadi jenama yang program, ni kau kita hehe anu tu kita doa mau turah doa ma. Lebo, napa makanan ini mai terdiri dari jenis warga soka, agere, mana ge, nama mana ge ni mau adu alia anak orang. Adu makai aku program, ada mana ge yang masih anak ge, orang tua juga sibuk dah kira orang lew. Turu kami tanya guru, kau jadi jenis warga soka, agere mana ge. Nilia jeso aga soka aga re managi nama nagi ni mohado arya anakura magadena taja ta oza ya kewali no goma kada kara ma. Ako ganya, ako ganya, ah. 
nigwa joke kuigwa wega itanada magoku joke gukoroho jage gukoroho rege de itwaro goswa na muriyo na roho mutheru o ta uria gotarie ke abereria na uria gotarie reu na uria gwatue ka hingo siothe tene na tene america itwe karethe to muria mudu gwitu mr james getau okay atunyite ogeni thini wa gikaro reke ah james getau え、かめめ。森へが、におで。え、森へがとくみえイエスクリスト。とくみえでしおで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで。え、におで
eight na agita kigeranio igeranio siake sia o levels form four ni aso kire agidi skuru wa KMTC na kuru korea ekire diploma de ni wa team for medicine na akirekia mwaka ine wa 1982 buba osio ni gerile medical training college Nairobi Nairobi korea ekire diploma de ni wa anesthesia na akirekia mwaka ine wa 1987 wera nya de kirota kliniko ofisa dipitari itigane teta bika level 5 hospital garisa level 5 mandera hospital na kirugoya hospital duda osio nya rutire wera ta kliniko ofisa denye wa office research a uh, foundation grero nya shokire akiruta wera dipitari siake kiobe kondo gotiganete Tasta Saba Saba James Medical Clinic Latora na Arari Gerelie Furuma Medical Services Muranga Mukoyo Kohikania Kure mwaka wa 1985 Nimeda nilena mwedua wake Mere wako ingorege Na makihikania Na mwaka ine wa 1990 Makihikania na mutumia wake wake Erinue Margaret Jerry Morege wa Dika Primary ni mata na hilo na siana na nishio Dorcas wa Boy Morege wa Memorial School Robert Morege Robert Dongo Morege wa Kiyare Solomon Kibe Morege businessman Oscar Mugai Morege Morin wa Boy Morege wa Del Monte na Robert Dongo Morege wa Kansas USA Arare isisiara wa Veronica Wairimo ukawa Samuel Morege Merilyn Wangui na Kayla Wangui Kanida Samuel Arare mumeba murumwa Kanida wa SK Church na kore mweri 20 mweri wa mwaka wa 2017 ya mweri wa mumeba wa Kenya Anglican Men Association nikio kama arari gereirie ari mumeba wa SK Salama Church Duari Motiga ire atorete na ugimu mwega wa mwere matuko make mothe no kuri mwaka ine wa 2020 nya gereirie kuigua mwere oru na agathondekerwa bibitari tiganite ta Kenyatta Hospital Sorry, Kenyatta National Hospital, MP Shah, KU Referral Hospital, Naidu Hospital, na Dika Memorial Hospital. Kure mweri idato disemba mwaka wa 2022, nye heironi mweri na ake mudho kio dhifitari ya Naidu Hospital. Kure ahuru kilio ni mwadhani mudhe nya waju matatu mweri idano. December 2022 na madama madama tha ila tosia otuko ara hurukire ena okorwa mia kamirogo itandatu na itano ne atiga atumia kere siana siake na tososo ni mwaga ni waheanire Samuel na noe wa musokera etwa ria mwaga ni kirogo so amen Eulogy of the late Samuel Murege Dongo. Birth. The late Samuel Murege Dongo was born on 6th December 1957 at Manata Village, Sabasaba, Muranga County. His parents, the late Robert Dongo and the late Dorcas Wamboi. His siblings are Jane Wanjiro, John Jane, Mary Wairimo, Margaret Nyambura, Peter Kamau, and Beth Wanjera upbringing. He was brought up like other children of those days, helping his parents with household chores. Education. The late Samuel Murege Dongo started his formal education at Sabasaba Primary School in 1967 up to 1974, 
when he did CPE examination, in 1975, he joined Jerry's High School up to 1978, when he did his O-levels from four. Later on, he joined KMTC Nakuru, where he pursued diploma in clinical medicine and graduated in 1982. Later on, he joined Medical Training College Nairobi, where he pursued diploma in anesthesia and graduated in 1987. Work. Samuel worked as a clinical officer in various hospitals like Dika Level 5 Hospital, Garissa Level 5 Mandela Hospital, Kelgoya Hospital, among others. He later joined Coffee Research Foundation in Ruiru as a clinical officer. In 1990, he designed and operated a number of private clinics in different places like Sabasaba, James Medical Clinic in Gatura, and Huruma Medical Clinic Muranga Mokoyo. Marriage. In 1985, Samuel met and married his first wife, Mary Wangoi Morege, and in 1990, married his second wife, Margaret Jerry Muregi. They were blessed with children, namely Dorcas Wamboi Muregi, Memorial School, Robert Dongo Muregi, Kiare, Solomon Kibe Muregi, businessman, Oscar Mungai Muregi, Maureen Wamboi Muregi, Belmonte, and Robert Dongo Muregi, Kansas, USA. He was father in law to Veronica Wairimu and grandfather to Samuel Muregi. Marilyn Wangoi and Kaira Wangoi. Church. He was a devoted follower of ACK Church until his demise, whereby his last church was ACK Salama Church. He became a member of the Kenya Anglican Men Association, Kama, on 20th July 2017. Sickness. The late has enjoyed good health throughout his life. But in 2020, he was taken ill and he has been receiving treatment at various hospitals like Kenyatta National Hospital, Mpisha, KU Referral Hospital, Naipi Hospital, and Vika Memorial Hospital. On Saturday, that December 2002, his health deteriorated and he was rushed to Naipi Hospital, where he succumbed to illness on 5th December 2022 at around 9 p.m. He has rested at the age of 65 years. He survived by his two wives, children, and grandchildren. It's God who gave us Samuel Murige, and he has taken him away. May his name be glorified. Amen. <laughs> Oh, 
Tua kenya hau neto kugia nado me kuali ami ari tali meike to do mau do baike mamu do weto la mueri ne mago ete to dei ne waro na ruto ado meru na ko na ko na ko yomu eke oyo ado malo mane leo kugu eta to gei na ini ro mu do weto robinson moagi na ho harata he na mu do weto mesta ga voka na ne ekonomi na mora to gei wa korea mali host mali to stops hospital Ale kata na ke ne ko gweta ma wudu ma tale ma yike ko to ko ma no to ko abia na mudu o gweto robinson a mo ake. Ai kala ke ho kwa na ko me ha duda wa kwa in rus a ke ko na le ha ku he a ne to ko ya mudu gweto mesta ga toka o ke a gwete ma wudu ha du ni ha arata. Eh na tuna tuna abu atu tu tu miru luga ya kiswahili kuna wengine awelei uh, luga yetu ya centro eh machine yangu ni pita kadoka mimi nimeambiwa nionge kwa niamba ya marafiki eh ni seme huyu amelala hapa ni rafiki yangu sana Tuli anzana na yeye tukiwa hiyo kijiji tumesoma hapo inaitwa Saba Saba huko ndio tumetoka na ndio tumeanza wazazi wetu wakatuonyesha mapenzi tukakuwa tukapendana sana tukaenda primary school moja tukasoma pamoja e, tukasoma secondary pamoja mpaka ye yeah, alikuwa mwaka mmoja mbele yangu lakini hiyo mapenzi hata wakati alienda medical na mimi nikaenda mahali nilienda ikaendelea kwa hivyo nikiambiwa nionge eh, sababu ya marafiki na fikiri mali alienda kufanya kazi kama mali si kuenda ni Garissa na na Madera lakini Kerogoya alikuwa ananiita huko tunakaa na kanijulisha marafiki zake kofi pia eh alifanya namna hiyo kwa hivyo mimi naweza sema murege na muita murege eh sababu ndio jina nilizoea sana e, ni mtu wa watu na na marafiki wengi wengi sana na mimi nafikiri na wajua wengi na wajua sababu tulikuwa tuna sikizana sana kwa hivyo kwa niamba ya marafiki ningesema tumepoteza mtu ambao ni mzuri tulikuwa tunaongea alikuwa na na mawaidha mingi alikuwa anapatia hakuwa na na enemy na mtu yote alikuwa rafiki na hayo yote eh, bibi yangu naye ni kazini yake kwa hivyo kifamilia tunashikana kwa hivyo sababu watoto wangu wanamuita anko kwa hivyo kwa niaba ya marafiki ni sema ya sadani sana na tutaendelea kushi, kushikana asante asante sana mpigie ni makofi so kwa nafasi hii kuna mwenye alikuwa amepewa kwa Inros Inros anaitwa Robinson Mwangi kama ako karibu na kama hayuko karibu Uh, kwa rafiki mwingine kutoka uh, mali uh, stops uh, kuje aoge kwa niaba uh, kama rafiki kutoka sehemu hiyo ako karibu mmoja alikuwa ametengwa kusukumusia kwa niaba ya hiyo hospitali ya mali stops inaonekana e, wako karibu haya Sasa so, tutaendelea tu. So kwa kwa wenye walikuwa wamepewa nafasi ya kuzungumzia ni hao. Maybe labda tuulize kama kuna mmoja wa administration hapa either chief ama uh, assistant chief. Kuna ama vile jeroda. Utire. Thank you. Tutaendelea tutapea wakati huu eh, nafasi hii kwa SDA kwa ya. Wabese kumsifu Mungu kwa wimbo mmoja.
Kalibuni.
ukienda kule sehemu za kisi unakula chinza haka utaishi mahali popote wakati wa wote na kama unaweza aishi mahali popote hata binguni si utaishi binguni lakini ukiwa na shida na wanadamu hata binguni utakuwa na shida na malaika kwa hiyo omba Mungu akusaidie uweze kuwa na amani na watu wote Mungu atubariki wanasema gari ambayo haina namba plate ya kwani Eh, kwa hivyo jina langu ni Pastor Hardison Logova ambaye ni mchungaji wa kanisa la Seventh Day Adventist Church na hudumu katika sehemu za kule ruai kule kuelekea Kamulu Joska Kamulu Joska Mala pale. Hiyo ndiyo eneo langu ambalo nina hudumu lakini kwa muda mrefu tumekuwa hapa Thika kufanya kazi kishiriki pamoja na kina Mary Moregi kina Dorcas Wamboi kina Kipe na kina Yomo. Mungu azidi kwa bariki. Asante sana. Asante. Tutaenda kwa tribute na tutaanza na nephews and nieces ili wafuatiwe na sons. Uh, ya mwisho itakuwa ya wife. So niece and nephews vinyo mmetipanga kaite nikujeni. Yes? Yes? Nephews hawa Okay. Ah, son. When you ask my sons, what will you do with me? Oh, eta eta fadali kaya ni karibu eh. Ini tu kwa ita at least muda tu chenda ni sana. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I'm not a son, but I'm standing on behalf of the younger son, Robert Nogu Moregi, who is in the United States of America. He was not able to travel. So I'll just read what he wrote. Uh, and I start tribute to my dad. A few days have passed and I cannot believe that you are no more. During our last brief chat on the morning of December 4th, you never prepared me for what was to come. I never at any one time thought that I would be writing your tribute this soon. Before I left, we had a candid talk and you prepared me for the hard blows that life would throw at me. At the time, I never thought that one of, one of them was losing you. I was anticipating that I would see you in a few months, but I am yet to come to terms that to terms with the fact that I'll never, it will never happen. You were an embodiment of hard and smart work. From scratch, you built your life and lived it. You have played a key role in my life. You taught me not to limit myself and my abilities. You always emphasized how imperative education is. You told me that giving up was not an option in the face of tribulations. Your generosity was, was one of a kind. I was reminiscing about how you got swindled at one time trying to help, and at that time you raised the question, am I too good? Indeed, you found my auntie's words that when we give cheerfully and accept gratefully, everyone is blessed. You have been a force for good in other, in other people's lives. You fought a brave battle and you conquered. I will miss our video calls and constant phone calls. For the past few days, I couldn't help but think of making one last one. Your life was a blessing your memories will be my souvenirs with which I will never part till we meet again, Dad. Thank you.
Uh, Santi Sano next. Now we're going to get to the Kaitri Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, I'm the Orcas Wamboy. I want to read the tribute uh, on behalf of the nephews and the nieces. Tribute to our beloved uncle, dear uncle, we, your beloved nieces and nephews, are writing to pay tribute to you. You are always there for us, offering your love, support, and guidance throughout our lives. Your warmth and kindness knew no bounds, and you always made us feel like the most important people in the world. We will always be grateful for the countless memories we shared with you, for the love and laughter you brought into our lives. You will be deeply missed, but we know that you will always be with us in spirit. Rest in peace, dear uncle, and know that we, and know that you will always be remembered and loved by your nieces and nephews. With love and gratitude, your nephews and nieces. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. So, when you are on your behalf of your wife, I'm a camera on a to what I to somea, I do it with Jenny, the wife. Oh, come oh, come back in Moja. Yeah, when you are married, you want to find your cassia. Yeah, where I make Korea Korago, Kamakunae, Akonao, Kaitere, Akuje. I find it in the future and the other ways. Ala Kuja. Over the years, it's so easy to see why you are my favorite boss. But at the time, I didn't have enough experience to know just how special you are. Please accept this tribute as my way of honoring you for the positive impact you have made on my life. Working for you was fun. I looked forward to coming to work. We worked hard, but we also loved and enjoyed the day. You gave me a big job. This was an opportunity to show you my best work. It was probably a risk, a risk to put me in that role, but you never acted concerned even when your clients called me that tally. You explained expectations, you patiently answered my questions, and you are available if I needed help. You also encouraged me to believe in myself because you believed in me. You are genuinely interested in my ideas. You listened to them and encouraged me to pursue them to see if they panned out. If they were bad ideas, you left me to figure out myself. You gave me praise when I succeeded. When I did something really well, you were quick to tell me so. Your words were encouraging and they built my confidence. You said thank you often. You gave me opportunities to grow and develop. You did this by sending me to classes, introducing me to other talented people, and giving me caring, honest feedback. You asked me what I wanted to do in the future and you figured out how to help me get to that goal. I never had to ask for a raise or recognition. You are always ahead of that question and did the right thing. You asked me about my life. Sorry. You are patient and understanding. When I went through difficult times, you are patient and understanding. You were a role model. You mentored me in the skills and the values of a great leader. And the more I observed you, the more I aspired to be like you. You were a friend, a mentor, and a father figure. Your words of advice, positive criticism, and lovely review will always act as guiding principles in my professional and personal life. You fought a good fight, and all I can say is still we meet again on the beautiful shows. Let's defeat the town. Uh, thank you, uh, Pole. <laughs> May the Lord be and give you peace. A time like this. So, on the uh, uh, kwa kati huu tutapea uh, uh, bibi wake 
ili waweze kutusomea tribute. Ah, good. Karibu. <laughs> Na tukimalizia wa wana wale wametoka ICK uh, salama. Men, yes men, ndio watatufukia hiyo ki, ki eh, kipindi kwa vipo. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe. Amen. Kwa majina anaitwa Jerry Dongo and I have the joy of salvation. Nikasoma mm. tribute mm. on behalf of the whites. Life is too short. I didn't know that you were living. I still believed that you were to be discharged as usual. But God was whispering to you, come home somewhere. I thank Almighty God for being together for 31 years. And I, and I you, our kids had good life and they shall live to adore you. Two years of sickness were tough, but you could thank God, but you could thank God as you leave hospital. Out of your love for, for our children, you assist, I mean, sorry, out of your love for education, you assisted me to further my studies. Thank you very much. Where you are now, there is no pain. That fateful Monday that you left us, being an ambassador of peace, you requested us to have peace, and we shall maintain it. May your soul rest in peace till we meet again. From Madrid. Thank uh, you. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much. So, come on. Uh, Salama Church. Kujeni mbuo yusifu mungu kwa wibu mmoja. as far as the project of the church are concerned hakuwa na watu nyuma nilikuwa na ramani nasi hata nikikumbuka about two months ago mwezi wa 10 nilianza kumtembelea kwake nyumbani nilikuwa wazee zaidi ya 20 ili nikuonyesha kwamba nilikuwa tunasikiana pamoja na pia nikitaka kusema ya kwamba hata kama ameenda unajua ameenda mbali kwa zuri na tuta we are going to miss him. But let's do it. Let's see here. Asarama, Toa Kama, Aduli, Mokema Tegi Aduli, Akuma Indidia, Arama Doma Gahamu and now, Magadina Ben Akuina, Guru Benaru. Matodia Ganabe, eh? Matodia Ganabe, eh? Oh, <laughs> 
the lips ndio sababu nimekuja lakini akawa marafiki lakini kuna njia ingine tumeshikana ni ya kwamba ndugu yake jana tumeoa mahali pamoja kwa hivyo tumejuana akaja kwetu biashara akawa daktari wetu na ndugu yake huyo jana ni alioa dada ya mke wangu ningewaomba tumpende bwana tujuane naye juu ya mambo mengine yote yale tunafanya tupendane na Mungu kwa jia ya kibinafsi na jia ya kibinafsi ni kuachana na dhambi kutebea na bwana haya mengine unajua swali tumeongea megi ya James ah hata nilikuwa nafikiria anaitwa James unajua tulikuwa nafikiria hiyo ndio jina lake nasikia ni Samuel tulikuwa namjua James tulikuwa namjua hivyo swali ni hili wakati utakuwa umelala kama vile Mulege amelala Mungu atakuwa akisemaje juu yako sisi tutaongea na tutasema yale tunakujua ya hapa duniani lakini swali ni hili Mungu atasema kama wewe ni wake ama ni wa huyo mwingine. Hilo ndilo swali. Haya mengine ni ya kupita. Rafiki zangu njia ni mbili tu. Ya Mungu na ya kwa shetani. Swali ni hili ni kiketi. Wewe ukiva siku ya leo utaenda kwa Mungu ama kwa shetani. Na tuko na shida rafiki zangu niwaambie kuna miungu mingine watu wanaomba wanainamia na juzi tumekuwa na gari anaitwa wagikuyu na hiyo shida tuko nayo ahubiri nawaambia chagua kama ni Mungu wa Ibrahimu na Isaka na Yakobo 
ama ni Mungu hakikoi. Na ukichanganya wawili utakuja kuumia. Kama wewe nataka kutumikia huyu Mungu, mtumikie. Kama ni Mungu hakikoi enda kwa mugumo. Wachana na kura meza ya Bwana wachugaji wa kipeana. Uta Paul ameongea na sema wedu wame wamelala. Na wengine ni wagojo kwa sababu huwezi ukakulia meza ya Bwana na shetani. Mungu awabariki. Amen. Upigie makofi. Najua kuna lugha nyingine inaweza kuwa haipendezi sana lakini ni vizuri kwa watu kuambiwa. Karibu leo leo. Reverend Kadrin na mchugaji mwenzako, Lerida mwenzangu, familia na wapolezaji mwenzangu, hamjambo. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. My name is Lerida Hosea, waweru mureithi. I am born again. I love the Lord so much for saving me and for calling me to his ministry. I come from SEK St. Stevens, Mukoyo. Bapo daktari ya limalizia Na ninamjua daktari Personally Kwa sababu niko na kastiana Kalizaliwa 2018 Na kalianza kupata conversions Nika kapereka Amoranga hospital Katidua rakini haka kuacha Nika kapereka Dhika kwa daktari ya naitu wa Dr. Mukui Mawatoto akakatibu, akakabia, akapatia dawa, akakabia, akataacha kukunyo after CG 5, 6 years. Akakaunvast tena, nikakapereka moranga tena kwa klinik frani. Nikakapewa dawa zingine, nikabiwa hizo dawa katakunyo for life. Finally, kakakonvast mara ya mwisho, nikakapereka kwa Dr. Samuel. CG vida, nikafanya, CG ya nikapatia dawa gani. Lakini since then, hakajawai konvers. Sasa huyo alisema katakunyo dawa forever, sijui ya likuwa amesomea wapi kwenye daktari hakisomea. So I know him on that level, and what I can say about him is he was a very serious man. Meona Jane hapa akipeana tribute and alia, kwa sababu wanajua vila walikuwa naperekana na daktari. Kwa mamba ya kanisa, he was very active back in Mukuyo, and wakati kama wana prepare for their day in November kwe tu Mount Kenya Central inafanyika November I don't know whether it is the whole province wanaume wanapeda mahali wanakura buzi na he was very active he used to come na cheza mpida pamoja and he was down to earth so hivyo tu wanajua daktari mimi um Wachugaji wa ACK wakimaliza service kuna maneno wanasema na huwa nasikiza vizuri sana. Wanasema vii muke vii nadhayo muke dane na munga tukatire muadhani. Go in peace to serve uh, to love and serve the Lord. Nino hitania tawotiri mutu katiri. Mutu katiri matiki hitania. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Kubo nigo niki muho era adwa family na igo de toke ite Tutore tuwe danete, na tukatire muadhani, muadhani ya rogo shomu. Sante. Mpige makofi. Sante. Bona asifiwe. Muadhani ya rogo shomu. Sijui, dugu yangu wa mewabia na hitu waje. Lerida Hosea. Tabia na hitu watu hivyo. Lerida Hosea. Kwa hivyo Hosea wanafaa kuwa Lerida. Sijui kama kuna kuingine. Bona asifiwe. Ahosea 4-6 Ando wako mwora kandiku wako mbenyo Mwata ni agosho Kwa wakimu niki wakimu kini yato inakiota Hoseas Watu wangu unapotea Kwa kutojua Kwa hivyo nigeomba Ndugu yetu wa mepu mzika Kuyo tumebu release Mwana asifiwe Kazi yaki ya mefanya na akamaliza Ameenda kwa sababu wa memaliza Mwana asifiwe Yako unaijua Nime wako mbenyo wako wako Nduko olene kwa wako mbenyo na mwodo wa menya kwa menyo, ni mwodo wa kivoki ya gai, na kutikili ya kivoki ya gai. Bwana asifiwe. Ni mwodo wa kivoki ya to ukoro, tuki ujiliyo na kiyo mwode, na to ukiyo na. Second Corinthians, Second Corinthians, chapter 12, verse 8 to 
a Corindo, o a Kerry, Murago e Cominegre, Quadelia, Inanya, Guinea e Comi. Togi Corotori Hau, Nego do Managedogo, I will read in English. Uh, I start from verse 8. Three times I pleaded with the Lord to take it away from me, but he said to me, My grace is sufficient to you, for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness. Therefore, I will boast all the more gladly about my weaknesses, so that Christ's power may rest on me. That is why, for Christ's sake, I delight in weaknesses, in insults, in hardships, in persecution, in difficulties, when, for when I am weak, then I am strong. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. So, kwa majina naitwa Joseph uh, Kemani. Mimi sio uh, dafika in charge wa huyu uh, ndugu yetu. Lakini tuko na dada yetu uh, Kadri Mchugaji ambaye amekuwa wana wana huduma pamoja. Mimi tumejiona na daktari kupitia kwa njia mbili. Ya ya kwanza eh, wakati watu wanatoka kuwa kehe kuja wanake nilipitia kwa mikono yake bora bora asifiwe huyo analijua vizuri kwa hivyo nikiwa nimesimama hapa nimepitia mikono ni mwake alikuwa mzuri bora asifiwe watu wetu wametola hata ukiuliza pasta hapa atakwambia kama uko aile hii na utapitia kwa mikono ya tulikuwa tunamuita James by the way kama utapitia mikono ya James una kasoro pahali kwa hivyo Hiyo ndio njia moja. Je, ya pili nimemtua kupitia kwa ndugu yetu Joseph. Uh, na nime hata nimetembea kwake, tume tumezungumza na yeye, tumeogea na yeye. Uh, na kwa hivyo kwa familia, Mungu awafariji. Mungu awape neema yake, uh, endelee kukaa nanyi. Na inajua ata, ata, atazidi kwa sitisia nguvu zake. Kwa maana Mungu ni mwaminifu, ni mwaminifu. Mwikale kwa gari. Yati huo. Mwikidelie huo. Na nama tale mana mwema jafiyo, wete kile kuthie kuwa na mwema kile kuwa na mwema kumeri. Kwa sababu, waka itigote. Jero soke mwema leti nake, ata huu mwabia na hiyo nukwe ya tuya kikuyu. Waka itigote. Na mwema jere, waka itiduro. Na nagetho kwa nekwa kiuwa ka. Kwa hivyo, kaini toko na hatika mwono, I want to recognize presence ya alimu a memorio. Na toko na tione head teacher wa memorio. Kwa kino wame hagu ole, nungo, unga hindi ya nungo. On behalf ya the memorio fraternity. Ndeta ya kula bona yeso ke. Eh on behalf ya memorials, osio nwe kule ya bwido tu mwa wa family wa akola go. We the congress your presence na nyonile team ya kuyo the goku. Mai to mwe kebega. I have given the me goku. Feel that you are in the right place. And we the congress your presence. Ngenya mwe kebega na bona adime. We have the the, the vika wa eli no tole. Na ne gola komo hene geda toka ibi to to ego wake. Ate na to inoke to inoke. Hallelujah. Actually, I'm not the vicar. I'm not the area vicar. But the area vicar is my colleague, a dean in the diocese of Moranga South. Tumekua na ye. Tumekua kwa mkutano pamoja. Lakini kwa shuguli topauti topauti. Akaeda ili kufanya kazi ingine. Mchukaji, karibuni sana. This is Game Palish. Adina liyaka didro. Na inyua the muigwe ni mugu wa teto ogeni. Amen. Lito liyakua nile varadipita, mweje. Nigo sarajiso ni udo wako honokia. Chukinta kikarugiki kwa maana huyu mze. Tulijuana na familia yake. Kuna wakati nilikuwa na hudumu parokia ilikuwa inaitu wa kakuyo. Na tukakutano na jamii na familia ya Bwana Samuel. Na nilipo juliswa Bwana Samuel ametuwaga. Na kasafiri kwa nyumba igine. Sio tu ya hapa ardhini lakini nyumba igine ya bayo inategenezo na mwenyezi mungu. Nikasema lazima nikuje nifaliji familia na nifaliji wapedwa wa Kristo. 
family ya mruide wito Samuel kio kele gemu mereria na kio kele deine wa Isaya kore de Isaya morago iko mina igire o igire kire baine geke niki watu de magoka in this mountain everybody will gather and in this mountain there will be a feast prepared by our lord jesus christ kwa hivyo familia ina mama molina na watoto wako na hao wa karibu sana ni vile tu mlima huu leo ni nyinyi kesho kuna wengine wataenda kwenye mlima huu but there is another hill where everyone will gather and that is where the lord will reward those who trust in him mwendo wa nyudo ulite aliyo giteini na mwako ine makai kauluka mwejera gado ni atirini ni nyu ni mwagi ya na mwendo wa mutaguliera no kule igoza lele lele tu na gayosi yo eta mwuduri yoyo eko mwumiriria amwekire hinya na adhi yake mwutu gaga na utugi wake this is not the end kuli musi ni kwa mufea na adu wake mainile tuwe takiri la godi na kogo kwa na kwa adu waya mwuduri yo na umusi ya diye ilo shemuli kandeti yo na eni uga adhi ya musi we have a home here and we have another home there and that's why Jesus said I go to prepare a place for you and I will come and I will take you there Samuel is in home Samuel is taken home where the Lord has prepared a home and a room in that immersion where I and you if we trust in God we will join Samuel in the feast of our Lord Jesus Christ. May God give Samuel peace as the soul rest in peace and may God give the family of Samuel peace as you mourn and you continue in the life. God bless you. God be with you. Uh, Santi, thank you so much. Nigewasi kila mwenye wetu tusimame ili tujiadae kwa neno la mungu taletewa na Reverend Catherine Tusimame, kaite ki, unajua si vizuri kukaa chini sana. Na katika programu zetu pale nyuma, unawibo, cha kutumaini sina, ila damu yake buwana. Tusimame, hali yore, kwa hana watakuru ugama, kaite lesi mama, tiwese kuhiba huo wibo. Cha kutumaini sina, ila damu yake yesu, Sina we mawakutosa Dhabi za kukusi osa kwa ke O mimi nasimama Die mwaba ni salama kwa ke O mimi nasimama Die mwaba ni salama Adamu ya ke na sadaka Na tege mea daima Yote chini ya kisa Mwoko si hata nitosha kwa ke O mimi na si mama Die mwaba ni salama kwa ke O mimi na si mama Die mwaba Salama Kwa kwa Yesu Niko tuasimama Ili buwana ukaweze kunena nasi Ili baba tukazidi kuchua Yale ambayo konayo Kwetu Siku ambazo bado tunaishi Nena nasi Ili baba tuzidi kukutumainia Na hili nilo ombi letu la imani Katika jina la mungu baba mungu mwana Na mungu roho mtakatifu Na omba tukaweze kuketi Kwanda Yesu wa sifiwe. Praise God. Hallelujah. Mwada ni Agoshua. Praise Jesus. Praise the Lord. Hebu angalia mwenye karibu na we. Kwa nini huinui mkono? Kwa ni hata we umekufa? 
Hebu muulize mwenye yako karibu na wewe mbona haujainua mkono mwenye hakuinua? Kwani hata wewe umekufa? Hallelujah. You know sometimes you just become ignorant and you know like now if we tell Samuel, Samuel hallelujah, tumwambie ainue mkono hawezi. Kwa maana his type is already up. He cannot lift his hand. So if you are living and you are breathing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. At least now I can see I'm in the church. Appreciate the Lord if you are living. Hallelujah. Wana sifiwe sana. Ambia jirani yako. As long as you live. It's so good to be obedient. Mukumbirie then. As long as you live. It's always good to be obedient. Wana tukuzwe sana. Indumwele mwani 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 Kwa majina naitwa Catherine wa Abui wa Kulia na mpenda Yesu kwa maana ameniokoa na amenidumisha katika uokovu na ninazidi kumshukuru na ninazidi kumtumainia na niombi langu la kwamba atazidi kunipa nguvu na nitazidi kumkiri kwamba yeye ndiye Bwana aishie ni leo na nitazidi kukiri Mungu kisha kwa familia ya Mr. Dongo Uh, Mrs. Mary and Margaret and your children, I bring my condolence to you as we say that may the Lord continue to console you, to comfort you in this your trying moment and may you continue to know that the Lord is there for you and he will never leave nor forsake you. Amen. And uh, I just want to say briefly, ya kwamba Samuel ni mshirika wa kiangirikana na tulikuwa tunashiriki na yeye pale salama sisi tumetoka katika uaskofu wa Dhika Dhika diocese that's where we serve in the Anglican church and by the grace of God I'm serving in Salama parish iko Elia watu wengi sana sana wenye wanajua Elia za Dhika wanajua pahali ambapo panaitwa landless and so we serve along that area that's where we fellowship And uh, mimi nimechukuja kujua Samuel like seven months ago if I'm not very much wrong kwa maana huo ndio wakati ambapo Samuel alikuja kwa kanisa na alipokuja aliweza kusema ukweli ya kwamba yeye ni mshirika wa kiangirikana na amekuwa akishiriki uh, uh, katika uaskofu wa Mount Kenya Central that is in Moranga around Moranga town watu wenye wanajua hii area sana and he was very specific the parish where he was serving and he said he was serving in St Stephen's Mukoyo na kama desturi ya watu wengi na hasa sisi wachungaji na ninajua ya kwamba hata mchungaji mwenye ametoka kwa SDA ambapo uh, bibi yake mmoja ana anahudumu kwa SDA i know You bear me witness, pastors we are fond of. When Shirika comes and he says or she says that we want to be fellowshipping with you, you always ask, where were you fellowshipping before? That's our, our chikacha. And I happened to ask uh, Samuel like that. Na ni wakati ambapo nilienda katika matembezi ya boma, which we call the pastoral visits, na tukaongea na Samuel. And I was to my surprise, Nilikuja kujua ya kwamba unajua wakati mwingine huwa tunawahudumia na hatuwezi kuwajua nyinyi wote and when time comes we are usually transferred from one place to another and uh, to my surprise when we shared with Samuel aliniambia ametoka St Stephen Mokoyo na tukaongea na I asked him when have you been fellowshipping in that parish when last when uh, up to, since when were you there and uh, maybe Lady Dahosea of Mokoyo I can tell you that uh, I was able to know that I served this man in that place because I I previously served in Moranga and I came to know in the year 2012 in the year 2012 I was serving in Mokoyo parish those people who are from Mokoyo maybe if there is someone there they can remember that Katine girl who was very swift in everything that she was doing and I was to be called then I was an evangelist then na walikuwa wananiita evangelist Catherine and then time I was clearing my college. Hiyo wakati and uh, wakati nilimwelezea mimi alinikumbuka kaniambia haya by the way mchungaji nimekukumbuka. Wakati huo ulikuwa kakonde. Sasa umenona. 
na nikamwambia vizuri nimeona kwa maana wakati huo sikuwa nimeoleka sasa nimeoleka na mimi ni bibi na ni mama na, me, na mzazi wa watoto wawili so we were able to talk and so i can confidently stand here and say that this man was a believer na haja hatujakuja hapa ili tu najua kuna mtu anakufanga na anatafutiliwa mtu wa kumzika hello nitoni ushumuli ganiti ewe wako ni ugetherero mudu wa kumzika Tutire ha ha gwetherera mundu ryo guthika mundu gwitwa Samuel Samuel kanitha wake nyari yetheire and so i have i am here i call them shirika that got here 2012 arashoka aragudagitha ka aragudagitha ka ni ngaroka aragora kwaguo ngihuji ha ha na ona ngiuga tiri ni ucoke tiri i am doing that with faith that indeed he was a believer and he has served the church where he felt good and uh, Uri amare na nagana mwadhani wake le ni hau dire ho we guy no we oi na kuria thi ni kuria mwadhani mari kana ile nake bana sifiwe so we we thank God because of this day and because of the time and the weather we might not take long mutugateri uh, i know this place kukinyesha wengine hapa tutajaribu kubeba tutajaribu kusukuma na hatutaweza so we must rush so that we may be able to spare the time for rains because we know rains are blessings and we don't want to take all that much time nataka tusemezane kuhusu neno ambalo tulisomewa na kwa dakika 2 3 hivi ningetaka tu tuweze kusikia neno la bwana na tulisomewa katika kitabu cha wakorintho wa pili sura ya 12 mstari wa 8 9 and if you can read that scripture the bible is very clear and i want to share with the family members it about the grace of god na huu ulikuwa wakati ambao ulikuwa mgumu sana katika maisha yake paulo na paulo anasema ya kwamba alimsihi bwana mara tatu aweze akamuondolea mwimba ambao ulikuwa unamdunga na maandiko yanasema ya kwamba Paulo alisema ya kwamba Mungu kila wakati alipomuomba Bwana alikuwa anamwambia ya kwamba neema yangu inakutosha. Kwa kuwa uwezo wangu unakamilika katika udhaifu. Na kwa hivyo nitajisifu kwa furaha zaidi kuhusu udhaifu wangu ili uwezo wa Kristo ukae juu yangu. Adhuhuri ya leo wapendwa Ninataka kurejelea kuhusu neema ya Mungu. Na wakati huu ambapo tunaomboleza kifo chake mwenda zake ndugu Samuel. Katika familia kuna yale majonzi ambayo yamewakumba. Na ni vizuri kujua ya kwamba when you are mourning we don't mourn in the same mood and in the same spirit. This is something that is usually very personal. Morning is very personal because it depends on the the part that you hand with the one who has died. And I know when I'm sharing this message I am directing it to individuals depending with the magnitude and what you are going through. Na kwa maana ushirika huu Mungu ametuitia dhuhuri ya leo. Ametuitia ili tukaweze kusemezana sisi zote. Labda uko mahala hapa Hawewe hawombolezi kifo cha Samuel lakini kuna yale mambo ambayo unaomboleza wakati huu. Haleluya. Because when God calls someone home, he knows that he has called a fellowship for those people who are living. And this is because there is a message that he has for us. And so this afternoon as I share this message, ninataka nisemezane na kila mmoja wetu mahala hapa. Kwa maana wengine wetu, familia Mary na Margaret na watoto wao wanaomboleza kifo cha baba yao, cha bwana yao na wao ni familia. Wanaomboleza kifo cha dugu yao, anko wao, hayo yote. Wengine wetu tumekuta hapa, lakini tumebebanisha mambo mingi ambayo inatufanya tuweze kuhofia na tukue na ugumu katika maisha yetu. Lakini neno ambalo nimeleta huo ni mwimba ukaweze kuelewa ya kwamba huo ni mwimba 
Na unaweza, you can compare this with that thorn that Paul had. And Paul prayed thrice that corn may seize that thorn from him. But the Lord told him, my grace is sufficient. Praise God. Amen. Can you tell your neighbor? It doesn't matter what. Preach to your neighbor, please. It doesn't matter what. Muhubilie tafadhali. Kama unawana ni mkristo, muhubilie. Hata kama si mkristo na ni muislamu, ama ni waio luga ingine, na unawana anakaa kupenda kristo, muambie, it doesn't matter what. The grace of God is sufficient. Tell him or her again, it doesn't matter what, the grace of God is sufficient. Right now, I know what our sisters have this afternoon. Probably they are asking, what next? The children, maybe they are asking, what next? But let me tell you, death is a bomb. And indeed, it has come. According to you, it has come at the wrong time. When you needed this man most. But I tell you, according to God's character entirely, this was the ideal time of God. This is because this man was in pain. I know I have visited him thrice or four times. Na kila wakati ambapo nilienda, hasa nakumbuka mara ya mwisho wakati nilienda. Nakumbuka Margaret alinipigia simu na akaniambia mchungaji sasa lazima ukuche. Juu huyu mzee sasa amekataa kila kitu. Anasema hata dawa hata kunywa. Anasema hata chakula hata kula. Kwa maana anajiuliza haja ya maisha ni gani? And I remember I visited him out of my very sight said you. Na niliingia kwake karibu saa moja hivi za usiku. Na tukaongea, tukaongea, tukaongea. Na ukweli alikuwa amekataa kukunywa dawa za hiyo siku mzima. Na tulipoongea, tuliongea, na kitoka hapo niliacha kama already asha kunywa hiyo dawa yenye alikuwa anafaa kukunywa kwa huo wakati. And I don't know, tulikuwa na daktari mwingine, sijui kama tuko na yeye hapa. Na tuliongea na yeye, tukaongea, tukaongea, and we were able to encourage him. And while saying this is that it was not the best time for us to say goodbye to this brother. But it was the right time for God to make his soul rest in peace. Why? Our timings and God's times are different. Amen? Our understanding and our reasoning is different from that of God. And the pain that this man was in, he found himself and God who was understanding. Praise the Lord. And that is why he caused him to rest. And out of this, it is not easy for us. But the grace of God is sufficient. Amen? Amen. Can you tell your neighbor, the grace of God is sufficient. Neema ya mungu yatosha. Family, I know it is not easy. But I tell you, neema ya mungu ya watosha. Kama jinsi ambavyo Paulo anasema. Ya kwamba mungu alimlodishia na akamuambia. Katika huo udhaifu, that is when I am well praised. My brothers and sisters in the Lord, who is in this fellowship this afternoon, I don't know what you are going through in your life. I don't know what are the pains that you are experiencing in your life. I don't know the agony right now you are going through. And even probably you are saying that the pains that you are in, they are more than the death that these people are mourning today. But I tell you this afternoon, just believe and trust in this God. He never fails. He will never leave us. And whatever he promises, he fulfills. Because God is not like a human being. Tell your neighbor, God is not like a human being. And he told Paul, my grace is sufficient. Because when you are weak, that is when I am strong. Can't you be there, my brothers and sisters? Can you stand on that crowd that makes God be strong? He rejoices in our weaknesses. Why does this happen? This is because our lives, we live a life of glorifying God. Na diyo maana Paolo, anasema, kupitia ula wimbo wama huwa tunamsifu mungu tukisema. Hotora guwa kwane muadhani, akuma veno, kogwa dire kedone igetige. For me to live is God. For me 
to die is gone. When for me, when I'm rich, it is gone. Even when I am poor, it is gone. Hallelujah. Amen. So what do we need to do, brothers and sisters? It is to cling on this God who never fails. And to let him, just let your God be God in your life. I've been having a testimony and a slogan that I've been going around whenever I have a, a moment to share. And this is the message I want to, you to share with your neighbor. That your faith, your faith is equivalent to the size of your God. Hallelujah. Can you turn to your neighbor? And I usually give a permission by the way. Nani mewasubua kuambia wambia neighbor wako kitu. Na labda umekanisha na neighbor ambaya huwa hamsenezani. I am fond of telling people, if you are seated to a neighbor who is not talking to you, I give you permission to wake up and go to a neighbor who will talk to you. Because in a church, this is the combination and the assembly of believers who are able to communicate to one another. Hallelujah. So tell your neighbor, neighbor, and if, if he is pointable, and you point him or her in peace, mwambia neighbor. Neighbor. Mwambia tena, neighbor wewe. Your faith is equivalent to the size of your God. What do I mean by that, brethren? That when, if you know that your faith is too little, that is equivalent to the size of your God. So that means your size, God is smaller and there are some things that he cannot be able to do. Hello? If you believe and if your faith is that big, that faith that can tell this mountain move and it moves, it is equivalent to your God that he is bigger. And you will be able to say, like Paul, that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Amen? Amen. Am I communicating to someone? Yes. That your faith is equivalent to the size of your God. Amen. If you believe that your God can do some things, that is what he will do. If you believe that your God will do everything, that is what he will do. When you have no peace, he is the prince of peace. When you are so low, he is the comforter. When you are frustrated, he is there to give you shield and he is our defender. When you are facing challenges and tribulation, he is there to make you stand. The size of your faith is equivalent to your God. That is why I tell you, brethren, don't be troubled. Just like Paul, he was going through tough moments. You can imagine Avon. It is not that easy. You are always in discomfort. But if you trust in this God, the grace of God will always be sufficient. He will see you through. You will go down through the valleys. You will be up on the mountains. Sometimes you find yourself in a desert. You will find yourself that nobody is there for you. But if God is there with you, you will make it because his grace is sufficient. Amen? Amen. So as I say, Family, don't lose hope. Don't give up. Trust in this God, for his grace is sufficient for you. Amen. The thorn might be too sharp, that it is piercing you, and that sometimes you are feeling as if you are giving up. But remember the grace of God is sufficient. Why? Because whatever is happening to your life, it never got God in surprise. He knew it, he understood it, and he knows the way after this. To us, mourners who came here, whatever you are going through, maybe right now as we speak, you even don't know what is happening next. You are facing cases that you are unable to know. You have faced rejection. You don't know what to do. You are facing rough times that even you cannot be able to tell. I just tell you, if the size of your faith is equivalent to that, to that of God, if that faith that you have is big, that you trust in this able God, a God who is never defeated. A God who is not a God of seasons. He is a God of all seasons. Just believe and trust in him. For his grace is sufficient. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Shalom. Asante sana. Mchukwaji. Kwa kutukubusa ya kuwa. Nema ya buwana inatutosa. Buwana asifiwe. Amen. That is a, a timely message for our family. 
Najua mtu atasidi kuwafariji bwana asifiwe kwa wakati huu tutakuwa na wakati wa matoleo ya saa ya shukrani nige wa request wana kama wajiadae kuchukua sadaka ni ajua Mungu atatubariki kama tumesimama sisi wote tusimame na tutaka kuomba kutoa sadaka tutakuwa na wakati wa kuombea familia na najua Mungu atatubariki Tuwa mena yuro yuwa de, nga da to hea na sadaka ina to kira na sio, de inge wa yuwa ko na lele, to keso kari yaga yiga do ne to do, wa okura hamu na yuwa no ya, akura to hamu na fa mbe leno, hata kama ame pitia magumu, mugu ame wasa idia, mugu ame walida, na hata ko akati hu, to na fa aku to lea mugu sukurani, wa kira jago. Bwana yu sehemu yangu rafiki yangu we katika katika safari yangu tatembe ya na we we pamoja moja na we we pamoja oh na we we katika Safari ya guta tembe ya nawe mali hapa sikuta kahiri ni esimi oh haya ni gute masaka sawa sa wanawe upa moja moja nawe pa moja. Who 
Unasta, oh hatuna mwigine Unasta, oh kuwapudiwa Unasta, yes Unasta, e kuwapudiwa Unasta, oh wakati wawote Unasta, e kuwapudiwa Unasta, yes Let us give thanks for these givings being the last service we are doing for our brother Samuel and this is in commemoration that today is his last time that we will be with him here physically and thereafter we will be having him in our hearts forever, shall we pray. Our Father and our God, we thank you for these givings that we have given. We pray that God, may this may be an offertory that we have learned that as it being the last physical service that we have had with our brother in his place of resting now. We pray the Lord you may bless this and that Heavenly Father that givings that we have given may continue to make the extension of your kingdom. And Lord, may this make and continue preparing a good place for our brother. And we pray that Heavenly Father may his soul continue to rest in peace. We pray that Almighty God in weaknesses, we will have your strength. And that God will continue to comfort us, and particularly his family, O oh God. We pray the Lord you may continue to encourage the church that you bought with the precious blood at the cross. Lord, we pray the Lord you may continue to encourage us and to remind us to prepare for that banquet feast that we are going to visit with you as we celebrate your coming. Bless us and anoint and dedicate and praise these givings that your people have given. May you bless us all and continue to help us yield more for the glory and honor of your holy name. This is our humble prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Family members, can you take a look at the casket? Ahuro, kia wedo, ine wa. 
Chukweda <laughs> No natural ricana gekeno, na drohe, idia siageire. Itore ine, rea samueli, asia liruo. Rea koga niruo, korea manyata, nago kiwo gemi. Gogetueka kore modo woka, na neoka woko deino. Waka inio sio to do meiro wa giri, mwemangana keda mamiro goetano na mugwaja. We want to thank you, Father, because since then you have been with Samuel. As he was so joining this journey of the elderly life, Father, we want to thank you and glorify your name. We want to say you are the Lord in his life, and you are the Lord even now, Samuel, you have called him home. Samuelani. <laughs> Mwadhani ne wa muheiri atumia ake. Alea mwadhani ya koreto hamwe nao na uke muradhi manasi ya nasi yake. Nekio toa marehe moko ine maku ihida ine riri. Netoe mwadhani famireno no magesi uria. Netoe mwadhani famireno mesiri ya mao no matengere. Netoe gorosi ya ono ilikere hida ine riri. Ona netoe ne mahute tio nege kuogeke. But we thank you, Father, because of the message which you have given us today. That your grace is sufficient. Father, we want to believe your grace will be sufficient to this family. Lea mwadha ni mego ikara matale na mwadu wa wao. Lea mego ikara makerika na metole ne. Na maodumane kamava tamade no. Na mwadha ni nivehereti ya Samueli. Gata gata ine kao. Mwadhani. We adole wati na vacuum kore ya doaku. Itekela mwadhani goka gata gata ine kao family no. Ake kora mwadhani gotile na mwa mara iguana. Na samweli arari getugege ako maiguidhania. Your grace is sufficient. Oka mwadhani na negeza waduaya. Matole mena inevedo ine waku. We want to thank you father. Netole Samueli le lele go kode da na ikara motore wa toho. Netole ero nea iguitha nilie nawe gai. Na ke madha keragi ya kunyoba ine aku. Father we believe you have taken him home. Kerea toa hoya mwadha ni no atiri. At this moment, at this dear moment the family is wanting. Father whisper to each one of them. The word of comfort. The word of peace. And more sour your grace to them. That they may be able to move to their life. You have trusted them. We want to commit them unto you, Father. More than you take care of Komatuga. You take care of more than you come on Meridia. You take care of more than you come on Tuga. Now you go guide your other men. You can come on to our own. Maka me nyaga be now. Maka me nyaga newe gai wao. Maka me nyaga newe maro bo ya gia. Maka menyaga niuri etu maga maodo mode maga asire. Neto odo we gai gata gata ine kao. Kanitha waku mudheru. Ule muadhani onaguwa gusakaya negetu geke mweke aguwa. Mo kristiano mwole igira ago dada ya hamwe nao. Onaguwa oo merelie na uwe kere hinya waku. Tutikoda gogoteti ya gai. Nemi akeo mirongo etada tunaidano. None ya keradimo. Samuel has finished the work. Someone has finished the race. Someone has fought a good fight. 
and now you have called him for less. Father, help us to continue with our less, to continue fighting this world that is wanting in our endeavor. And God, we believe that one day, even now, you will call us and we will march toward the heavenly home. Help us and pour your grace to us. Now, Father, whatever this family need, be the your provider. Because you are the Lord. To God, to God, to God, to God, to God, to God, to Dayo waku, ure kio korona family no. Wega waku, maigane. Na kio kira adi mogi yaku, wega ide mori na roho modelu. Vietole na family no. Na gei karana gie nao. Kia bire inege eke na godie na bere. Leu, ginya chene, ona chene. Amen. Awe koma kuega ide. Family, not to so kaite ide. Ima kega gia mono. Jerasia, <laughs> Samuel to rest. Now before then, because this is where we have been able to assemble comfortably, to Taomba Mwenye Alikua Ameteuliwa na familia, aweze kutupa shukrani ambazo familia wakonazo nyoyoni mwao, Mr. Jane, aweze kukaribia mahala hapa kwa maana hapa nipo tumekaa vizuri na ninaona if my my eyesight can serve me well, that is where the gravesite is. True? So, kwa maana, dugu yetu, Mr. Jani, akimaliza kupiana vote of thanks, tutasimama tumahali ambapo ako, ili tusiweze kutawanyika sana, na kwa maana kanisa ndiyo huongoza kwelekea pale kwa gravesite, kanisa tusisi ambapo tuko hapa ni sisi, tutaelekea pale na familia, Na diyo mana nasema ya kwamba tutasimama tumahani ya bapa tutakuwa. Lafu sasa tukielekea pale mkiona tumetanguliwa. Tukiwa tumeongozwa na kanisa. Sasa wengine tutaweza kufuata. Na wani ambao wako mahala pale naona tuni kupinduka tuwa patapinduka. Diyo tuweze kuendelea na ibanda ya mahala pale. Wana sifiwe. So we request Mr. Jane kindly have this microphone that you may pass the vote of thanks to the, to the members. Karibu. Uh, friends, relatives, and all gathered here. Murega, Gaini Murega, Nahide Shio there, Matania Rogo Shaw, the Mukumia is of Christo, Nova Muakan is a big one on a one in Doiga, Gitavo Johnny Jane, Na Mokotori Mushi, Oyo Komet and Mokuro Akua. Nini dengu muda wa ke, wana my brother, na juge beren tura tena muada ni, ni juu wa kutoa muriye, miaka mirogo ita datu na makiria, miaka mirogo ita datu, ira doa mut, tu kena jadi ni mereka tu dokuri atau ikim orang yang nari kau tu ayah kana gak kah, orang yang mutmi orang, korua he kana orang gak kah. No kai na tu hete aka he na itu ka muana ke na itu ka muduri na itu ka guka tu ke muana ga muata ni aro gosho 
Gayusio usio kilo watu he weather jaga grace ya gayu kami na juta family ni tau dohuila ni tuar na kima kokina na muno binya tu kali aku tu kaya na aku wogo mitu ni kile soil na kilo aku dono wogo kuwa gayi ati niya tu he weather ahul di mai kura iguru gaya rogo show ni ko show kaya jo kali ya kanida gado kanida na jiwa kanida kilo iya kanido mu ni tau doa hatu ya kanida wa masakaya Tuwe kanita wa masha kaya Na kahida kaya umuwe Temuga ya tekila uko umuwe karete Vi muko wa mire liyawe Naka mshio kari ya gado Bina yuwa hadu muhujia Ateta ate ya dunia maramisi behef Muhujia Kanita kaya mshio kari ya gado Kanita wa SK Mwe tekila uka igogona nere Kumokura mumire Mwoka mwa tigarami Mwoka adoro ine Nadiyo mwe complain Kari wa mwe amuna adime Na nadime kanidoshio Nono de Rema, SDA, ni wa yaga muno ni todo, yume de sara muno ni karafu, ya dira to uwe tara ire, maza ama kinya nire, ona adome, adome tina boeka, ga yuwa muwa mura adime, uwe ni wa anyu, oro de Rema, oro di ma kinya ma iki muno, oro kira iria, no kira ire ma, no kira me kuru, muro ra di mone ga i, SDA, ni wa yaga muno, ga yaga mura adime. On a idu ya do family, family members, brothers and sisters, cousins. Ana mo ko kuna ala tu nita nei da wega muno. Gasha oki agado. Nito do we ro wa sa mo ni mo le gele to kore to to ke oto lidia wega esa family. Nato ka ko tu nita nei da wega, wega muno. Ko tiri he de to ke te, to wa kinya hado, ko tu ka te hi hi de to wa ka te do ita wo dead end. Mo tu to ra to lidi lidia wega. Mo tanya to hi mo le kanida, mo tanya wo mo de. Wafu haki kawega na wakinya nila. Family members, na rata. Uwose wakile muu kwa wakuta kanya muu. Despite hard economic times. Gai ya kwa na mwafu kwa usio na usio kere liye. Onawe hali ya kukuta kanya muu. Gado kulewe ina defense. Jyo kere liye. Onara anake. Miwega ni mnejeshi. Asi ya mwalu tewe na mwune na mwuno. Wago dhodeka. Mushiure wa my brother Wako huruka Maisha masiyo mage mwode Mewe ya lahu kubuto na kumo Na kore higa Na mimura utila wera wega na kwe utila Kwe utila kunene Ona hiti ya kura atu ya kwa kura Mutina shawa Mutina koro mo Kegoa kujiwa kwetu kwa 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 Nimura utila na apena na mura utila wera mwega Gaiwa mwoyo amura abime Gaiwa mwoyo amweke wega Gaiwa mwoyo amura kare mahita ini mwode Hidup dia mula gugur di juga ah orang ini wajah muka tak tahu kena gaya kerugi ke ini wajah hari ini way gun wash ok dia gado ni family ino ya samuel muregi ni tu ya tu nak korok tu tino kamera di kodu kiri toro oke hadu wira ini this a commitment tu ahi kamera udah mai tu tu ke tu kiri samuel muregi Ohoro adi ya kahuruke Na Igu wa gano kumura toko muhoera Na tuu yatea Weke ya kahuruke Roro nero gedo toete Weke ya kahuruke Gai wa mwa roo mwa adima La juwe lewega wana niko heo kanya kahu Wa ushoki ya gado Lewega ahujia Na daiwa moyo amone kanire jana masa sima hida ni moze family si ni tuka si akura di mo ni tuka si ago kila mehaka uite kuyele kuanyu si ana si ani wigi teruwa nenga yusio nuela. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Mr. Jane. Tumpigi ya makofi tafadali. Nasi tuasema pia na we baraka kuako kuajiri ya kutupa shukrani. Asante. Now we are almost there. Na tutaomba kwa maana hii ibada siku ya leo tulikuwa tunashirikiana kwa maana tuko na wapendwa wetu wa STA na sisi so we will request the choir because you've done it so well when we will be now raising the dini you will, will be there to, to help, help us in the so you have heard them they have a sweet melody yes yes so kindly prepare for that you will be there with us there we sing together and uh, mchungaji ni wewe utatupa baraka tukiondoka mahala hapa kwa hivyo as we lay 
to rest after we have uh, we have laid our brother to rest na tumerudisha mchanga na tumepanda msalaba ili tuyo tukaweze kuondoka mahala hapa na tuzidi kuacha amani katika hii boma mchungaji tuomba utatupa hizo baraka na kwa ajili ya utukufu na wema wa Bwana Bwana asifiwe sasa naomba tukaweze kusimama tulize familia waweze kwenda pale katika jeneza ili wakaweze kusaidiana kubeba kwa maana kanisa wakiongoza na wazee ni wao walitoa kwa gari sasa tuwaomba familia nao wakaweze kubeba jeneza ndio tuweze kupeleka pale pa kwenye uh, kaburi na sasa kama chinsi ambavyo tunaele masomo ambayo huwa tunaenda tukisoma and that is what we will do so we highly request that we cooperate as we have requested family members wenye wana watasaidiana ndio waweze kubeba jeneza tafadhali KCM 058V umefunga barabara tafadhali uende ufungue e, KCM kindly go and clear the way e. so familia lakini mtoe maua tusaidiane familia maybe some ladies can come and help in calling the bank back maua tusaidiane kubeba maua tafadhali Nakeje swa kimwiratire neniye kuriyo kana neniye muoyo uriawe hokete niye ona kuona wagatura muoyo na mudu wa wode muoyo na ke hokaniye dari higo wagakua no wado aigia ku ari amagakoro makometero kogo ini rwadi ni makali ukio amwe mali ukire muoyo ini uri autagadira na wale age mali ukio negenda masono kidio wale hao wageni magashagara ta ukaigua matumairu na wado wale mashoka giado ale ya aigejira ine ya udhigu matore makegete taja ta tene na tene nijo ya te mugorie muoyo na te marigeredio ine ya karuga maadhe teri ni uyo
asante sana kama familia wamemaliza pia kanisa tunataka kuapa hii nafasi so we request the SDA for your Mary and her family fellowships Yes, dear family members, kindly come and we give you this chance. If the family is done, yes, dear family, we request Salama Church family also to join hands, please. Yeah. Asante. Yes, dear, kindly help her, kindly help her. Thank you. Yeah. Asante. Yes, yeah. to Msaidi Tafadali. Yeah, it is okay. It is okay. Mm. Yes, dear. Now it is your turn. Salama family, tujiandae na sisi tufuate wakimaliza. Asante sana. Thank you. Tufuate hivyo. Thank you. Ya salama family kindly. Thank you so much. Tufuate tupite hivyo. Thank you so much. Asante sana. Asante sana. Thank you. Thank you. Salama family can see you. Yes, tunabakisha hivyo. Tukichukua kama tunapita ndio tuweze kwenda pale pia tushirikiane pamoja na wapendwa wetu wa SDA hapo ndio tusaidiane kumsifu Bwana. Yes, kwa utukufu wa Bwana. Asante sana. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Sasa wengine tujiandae wapendwa sisi wote ndio tuweza kusaidiana kurudisha huu mchanga uh, kwa njia ya mepesi libyo tuweze kushirikiana asante sana ikatsi na salama family thank you thank you so much thank you thank you yes thank you thank you
楼下，马飞。
Thank you so very much. Watoto wote nanyi mkuje mwekelea hii da ingine ni kubwa. Children, all children, kindly. Shianashio de Sir Samuel. Ukai, please. Shiana Sir Samuel, ukai. Ukai mwena oyo. Sorry, sorry niko mwine nina na nwa kamera, please. It's because where the space is. It's okay. Mekine wanakucha ama watasimaliwa na hawa. Yekai karibieni tafadhali, yes, thank you. Yeah. Asanti, thank you so much. Naona kuna yale maua ingine ambayo tumepewa ya kupanda kivietu. We will do that when you give us the blessings as we recess from here. We wish you well. Tuende tuwe na wakati muama mahali ambapo tutaenda, tusafiri sarama. And because we might not meet with some of you, wherever you go, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a blessing year 2023. And it is our prayer, the next time we will meet, we will be celebrating a hot morning. God bless you so much. Chukari. Tunaomba, tuombe, wala na uzumumuza, wala kona kofia, tunafanya ombe na mwisho, tuombe. Mungu baba mwana na romu takakifu, Siku ya leo tumeshuhudia matokeo ya dhambi. Na kweli tutalia na hata Yesu ulilia. Lakini nakushukuru Mungu kwa sababu kuna siku ambayo utakuja na wakati huo kifo kitafika mwisho wake. Tutaishi milele na milele bila kutengana na marafiki zetu. Tunajua ndugu wetu wamelala mavumbini na neno lako limedhibitika kwamba ni la kweli. Na sasa kile tunachoomba ni kwamba Mungu sisi ambao tuko hai tunajua hatuna muda mrefu wa kuishi katika ulimwengu huu. Kwa siku chache ambazo utatusaidia za kuishi katika dunia hii baba. Na sisi tufanye uhusiano tutengeneze uhusiano wetu na wewe uweze kuwa mzuri na uhusiano wetu na wenzetu ambao tunaishi na wao zidi kuwa mzuri ili siku zetu zikifika Yesu kama tutalala tulale ndani yako. Na kama Yesu utakuja ukitukuta tukiwa hai, tubadilishwe mili, tuende tuishi na bila matembele sote. Amen. Bariki kila aliyehudhuria eh, sherehe hii ya mzee Samuel, anapoenda nyumbani Yesu zidi kumbariki. Na majina yetu yote yazidi kudumishwa katika kitabu cha uzima cha mwana kondoo. Tusamee kila mmoja wetu tutoke hapa tukiwa tumekubalika machoni pako neema yako izidi kuwa nasi hata wale ambao wamehusika katika kuongoza huduma hii kuendelee baba kuwabariki hapa neema yako uzidi kujifunua kwako kwa njia kipekee na hata sisi zote uzidi kuwa pamoja nasi ninapojitayarisha baba kuingia katika mwaka wa 2023 neema yako itutoshe sisi sote asante kwa kusikia na kujima ombi yetu nikupitia katika jina tukufu la Yesu Kristo tunaomba. Amen. Amen. Now facing each other may we share the ones of grace. And now may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Shalom. Thank you.
na keje so akimwiratire nenie kolio kana nenie muoyo uri awe hokete nie ona kwa no agatura muoyo na mudwa wothe we muoyo na ke hokanie dari higwa gakua no adwa igia ku ari amagakoro makomete rokogo ine rwathi ni makario kio amwe mario kire ndiyoya na mwere wako oyo wanya mawe korodo leho ideo nego na gai ni kweone la gamu yone la aliwa mwena wakwa maido makwa ni mwamaka mwero nila na kima mudu ugi goroya kwa nila hea hea kwa na mwenye usio ulea wako tora niyari aga kihubu wa guwa isi jero na dile hede Kada <tos> Nikuwa hali ya dee nye mwikarage ho. Tiyara hila kedo wana kego kode. Ona tutikihota ona ase ya kuluta kedo kuo. Ni muadha ni wa heani de Samuel. Na ni muadha ni wa musokera. Leto wale ya muadha ni de Rogoso. Amen. Nikole foro di mwegama. Atogete kia kwa wana. Ini kau 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 jisoh, eh 
matora ga hamwe nawe nigi we na fudisi ari matiketie yashare ke gutigana na menawe ya mwere imete igaikaraga na gutena na itane nawe ukorewe tokugata na ma yodo ndo yetikirita gutikirikanya dogwe no yito samuel na madina madeno na mehia na tokugo ba igate wetikire ni yodo autugi wa kumweka utaroki ya dwale ya dure ndiwe idaletari haya na utume ba matu wa kunyure guka Nikata ikwe hamwe na ale ote mana kume oke tena mare tuwari ya kuru ya mbure Tuka higenyo mao tuma ya nega tuwari ya giria Na tuka kenaka muno Tule na mele ito ona maro hama ito Kune nini wa kuta kiraga na ulea wamede na mede Yoto wa jeso kristo muadani wito Ame Ga iwe ebu yu ito nega Ito wa muadani wito jeso kristo Ulewe kurioka na nikende wa mwoyo Ona nike au ya wote ya kwe hokete Ona hako no wakatura Na mwoto ya wote atoye Na wakupe hoka adaka kwe medio na midi Ona nike na wale watu kutina na wakupo wako mwote ya lwe tako pol Atiko tika wale wikuwa ka oru Ni wato wale wako mea tedine wake Ota wale ato ala matale laki ya regele no mekaga Tuwako hawa ya natuwa kwa ila mwa ya mitu yi heti ya Ida wito Kutu kiyo kiyo kwe na wale wange kuo Kya mea hiti ya tukika nena mo Tukiaga na dhidi ya nao kiku Nikaeta ate Dhele ya tuwa kuwa Tuka huroka dhele wake Awata tuwa kuwerege la ate Samuel Nia huroka Na tuwa kuwa ita ate Kedele ya kuyoka kwa tuwa ya oze Kutenye olia wa ijiteru Ona ikwe tuwa kuwa tuwa ya tuwa ya magere ije Agwe tekiru niwe Na tuka heo kena atimo Kila mwuru kumwede muno Akara ni madu na kio Alia oze makuwa dete na magwe tigira Tere ya kamera Ukani yue shana la dine shawa Watayu kama kiwele mwe kwa reke yuo Watakea bele ya gyaze ino Etekea kutuhema ya togo la ila mwadani Ida wito yu yonera Ni yodo wa moto kwa ila nilehi Na moto kori Jesu Christo Amen Bona sifiwe Sasa naomba tukaweze Kualika familia Ndiyo wakaweze Ata wawo kupata hii nafasi Ya kumwaga dugu yetu So I request the wives, Mary and Margaret, and the children, please, if you can be near, I would like us to do it together. Tukufanya tukiwa pamoja, usimwage mchanga bele ya mwingine. So naomba familia, the wives, and the children, kindly, mweza kupata mchanga kila mtu yake. And then I will say in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, then you will draw together. So kindly have with you a portion you can do it with your hand with your hand kindly yes thank you so much now maybe now release the husband the father to go in peace in the name of god the father the son and the holy spirit together thank you thank you thank you thank you yes it is well it is well it is well it is well It is well, it is well, it is well, it is well. Yes, tuwa saigie tafadhali, tuwa saigie tafadhali. Nimizu ni kwa mwage mchanga, usiachia mtu wa simwage, wata mwage, lakini tuwe karibu na wawo, yu tuweze kwa saigia. Kunao, family members wegini. Other family members, please, kai tuwe kamu, we want to give you this opportunity that we will do it. Kai tuwe kamu na wela, usiwage, Angelena, what a kind of surprise, yes.
Thank you.